It's one of the most challenging things to do in the game of football, but the Seminoles have turned it into an art form since their first season in 1947. 65 times the Seminole defense has made a famous goal line stand, 65 times they've had sack parties in the backfield, and 65 times the opponent has gone home with a big fat zero on the scoreboard. But as time goes on, that task becomes harder and harder. Just ask this year's defense, which added shutout number 65 to the storied Seminole legacy. It's very tough. Uh, it was at one point where they, they, luckily they went for it on fourth down and we stopped them. Because uh, they probably could have kicked the field goal and then that would have sucked. Uh, we would have gotten shut out. I think it's definitely playing one play at a time. Once you get up on the opponent and you and you want to maintain that shutout, it's definitely start to slow the game down and play the game, at, play, play a play at a time. And I think that's how you maintain a shutout. It's not easy. Any lapse of consistency or mental focus can lead to a big play and an easy scoring opportunity. But that's something the Knowles work on year round, even during fall camp. Most teams would probably just, uh, just go and say, oh, we had a good half, but uh, we prepare a lot during the off season, like for situations like that, just to keep us, you know, keep us going, and uh, just to know that we is up. Or they haven't scored in the first half. We, in the second half, we just wanted to come out and just play as hard as we did in the first one. And that's something the Seminole offense loves to see. I mean, we knew our defense was going to be great this year because we go against them every day. Um, so you know that that gives us a lot of confidence, knowing that we'll be able to get the ball in good position, great field position. Our special teams is really good too. Uh, Coach Fisher and Coach Graham pride themselves in that. So you know we're always going to have you know good position with the ball, and uh, you know it's up to us you know re to repay and thank our defense by putting points on the board. So that's a you know big part for us. But don't think the defense is resting on their laurels. No matter the opponent, there are always things to improve. Fine tuning things. I mean, working on techniques. Like I say, it's football. You never know what can happen. And like I say, just respect your opponent. Like Coach Fisher said, you want you got to respect your opponent. And how you do that? By giving them your best, playing football. And for the Seminole defense, respect starts every week in practice and never stops. They're hungry for number 66. I'm Scott Kodak reporting for Seminoles.com.